I don't really think of myself um, as a female leader. I just think of myself as a leader. And I think that I'm able to think that way because of the work of the forum members who have been in those leadership roles for so long and have paved that way for me. And so, um, you know, for me to be able to be surrounded by them is really special. I joined the forum in 2013. I became president of AT&T New York, and I think that that um, responsibility made me a fit for the forum in a way that I hadn't been before. I'm younger than a lot of the other women in the forum, and so for me it's really wonderful to have so many mentors who can teach me about having a leadership role in a company um, and where my career can go from here. It's, it's inspiring for me. It's a community of women who all have so many things in common, but yet so many things that are, make them different. And that's what was so attractive to me about the forum, the fact that all of these women have accomplished such great things, but at their core, uh, they're committed to New York. They're committed to making New York a better place. Um, they are committed to sharing their stories with other people and to building friendships. And also, I think as a new mother, um, it brought a different perspective for me to wanting to be a part of the forum because so many of the forum members are mothers themselves. And that perspective has helped me a lot in the past year as I've navigated my job and motherhood. I started really young building my career because my mother, who just became a forum member herself, which is extremely exciting for me to experience this with her and hopefully to enjoy some things as a mother-daughter team, she's always worked and she's set that example for me. She raised me but she worked full time, went back to work you know, right after she had me and I went back to work right after I had my own children. and. So I always had that example, and so from a very young age, I wanted to work. I wanted to do what she did. I pursued both ballet and politics simultaneously. Uh, I didn't go straight to college, which also um, really informed a lot of my thinking about what I wanted to do in life. I think what makes a good leader is being able to pick the right people to work for you. Um, to really invest in them, the time, the energy, to f make sure that they feel invested in what they're doing, to have that constant dialogue with them, and also to really communicate with the people you work for um, often to explain to them you know, how you see things and what you think could improve, and to ask for things. I took this job um, because when I interviewed with the chairman of the company, I said, in order to be successful in this position, this is what I need from the company. And if I can't get those things from the company, I'm not gonna be successful in this position. I don't want this job. I don't know that I'm a good leader. I hope I'm a good leader. I don't think I'm a great leader yet. I think I'm at the beginning of that real leadership role in my career. And I think that one of the great things about the Women's Forum is there's so many women who are great leaders in the forum and I'm hoping to be able to learn from them. The Women's Forum of New York is a place where I can learn and hopefully teach others what I've learned and make friends and grow. Mm -hmm.